guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I'll be reacting really to episode 11 of Asteroid and Love. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Yeah. Ow, I mean... Just wanted to be with your girlfriend. Damn. To surprise you. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of wondering too. You might vibe really well with them. I mean, who knows? I would really like to see in this episode, like, maybe some characters from other series by the people who have named not only this, but, like, uh, freaking, uh, anime I yell, <laughs> I'm about to say, hey, camp, lay back camp, um, new game, Sakura trick, I'm trying to think of something else. I can't think of anything else. J just literally, something. Little Easter eggs. They could just be in the background. Oh my god. It's kill me, baby. <laughs> oh my god. Like, guys, to see those characters from several different series, like, in the background just for a moment. It'd be good. Don't think it's gonna happen, though, but still. I'm hungry. I'm just cute. See you over. Really?
Oh, well, come on. God damn this face. Her friends. Not only that, but club members, you know? Yeah, that's their dream. And it wouldn't be fair if one just went, so you know, she had to go too. <laughs> you guys had to move. You have another one? I don't know, I like her, but she kind of creeps me out. A little teeny tiny bit. I have no clue. You might want to watch that one, Al. Oh, at least she acknowledges it. Yes. 
That'd be perfect for Ali and Nina. <laughs> Look at the soda. <laughs> oh. oh, cool. What are the quantities, you know? <laughs> yeah, because they're so going to reminisce. That's usually what happens when you find someone that you haven't seen in a really, really long time. You end up talking for hours. Interesting comparison. <laughs> So I don't know.
Right? I mean, it could be hard at first, but, you know, eventually once you get the hang of it, it could be easy. <laughs> I don't think you would be finished. You still have more dreams and more asteroids to find. <laughs> It's fine. <laughs> and plus, you guys are doing good today. You deserve it. And y'all are just making me more hungry because I haven't eaten yet. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> A lasting friendship.
<laughs> that makes so much sense. <laughs> She made like a whole bunch, my god. So sleepy. It's gonna happen because I think next week is the last episode. So I mean, it would make sense to kind of end it in the finale for them to find an asteroid that they could name. After Owl, and it's gonna be so pretty and perfect, and then I'm probably gonna cry knowing myself because it's just gonna be so emotional. <laughs> like, oof, big ol' oof, emotional cry. It's gonna be so good. But Nana, oh my god, Nana was like the star of this episode, even though it was focusing on Owl and Mina and the two new girls that we've met, but Nana. Props to Nana. Like, oh my god, she's so precious. I love her. And I kind of wish I would get a season two so that we could learn more about Nana and um, Sakura's sister because I love her. Best girl, I'm sorry. It seems like this episode was also weird because Suzu was mentioned, but Suzu wasn't in this episode. I mean, yeah, Suzu is more of a secondary character and just. Still, this is, I think this is now, like, the second or third time she wasn't, like, in it, but mentioned. It just still felt weird because it felt like somebody was missing. And you're, like, sitting here, hmm, I wonder who's missing. Suzu. So, I mean, big hopes and prayers that Suzu was in, possibly, maybe, if this is the last episode next week. Not 100% sure. I just gotta check. But it's just the biggest thing. We, at the beginning of this show, they had a plan to find an asteroid together and name it after Al. We're about to go on episode 12 next week. Predominantly, maybe the finale. It would be nice to just bring that back. Tie it in a nice, neat little bow and then be like, here, there's that asteroid. I mean, it's like, from what it's, from what happened in the last few minutes of this episode, you know, them making the dolls for the rain to stop and the weather to be fine and perfect for them. It's all the little connections, all the little bits that we've been needing in this episode they're finally coming together and it seems like everything is going out really well for them so it seems like it's going to happen i'm not 100 percent sure it just really depends on what could happen next week at the end of the day but so we're gonna know i still love the fact that you know you know and everybody else all got to hang out together and just you know chill for a summer vacation and go to the exact same place that they went to for the first time but bringing in the newer members because they can reminisce about the times when the first group went together and then they could just be like, oh, well, this is what we did here and this is what we did there. It was just really nice and it was really heartwarming and it makes you just miss, like, having those girls together. But because of the fact is, you know, uh, Momo 
Mama and Sakura, they're at college, and then Mira and Al are at this, you know, the place and such. But even though the other two are with the rest of the group, it still feels different. The dynamic of it is, it's still there, but it's changed, like, slightly because of the fact that you don't get to really get to see different characters. And I was thinking, especially going into this show, um that it was going to be someone like Kaon specifically in the end, that we were going to see from episodes one to the end of the series that this group would have been together until that last episode. I was assuming that they were going to graduate in that last episode, but no. <laughs> but it's okay. Just bring them all together in one last little, like, five minutes of next week's episode, and that'll make me happy. Even though you gave it to me last week. <laughs> because I'm going to need it again next week. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of Asteroid in Love. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Mattress One. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for possibly the finale. I'm not 100% sure. I gotta go check. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.